Hello friends, welcome to another Darktable tutorial. Today I'm going to demonstrate how to remove shadows from images in Darktable. So let's get into it. Right, friends, as you can see, I have got an image here and it is noticeable that uh, we have um, some shadows uh, in the foreground and also around here. So uh, we need to remove um, the shadows to get a brighter look of this image. So the process is very simple. We are just going to use a particular module to uh, remove the shadows from this image. Right, so you go to the grading menu and click here. Um, and then uh, under this menu, you will have uh, shadows and highlights module. If you don't see it here, you can simply search here. Uh, yes, here it is, um, shadows and highlights. We simply can activate it and this is the result. It looks okay, but uh, probably the image has been affected a bit around here. If we uh, apply this module to the entire image. However, you can always adjust the shadows and highlights according to your preference. Um, and then you may get expected results. So for an example, if we just want to apply uh, this module um, just around here or probably in this area as well that would probably be better so that uh, the entire image will not be affected so to do that we can use parametric mask um, and where you would find it well you just come here and you see here we have different menus so this one that is called drone uh, and parametric mask click here and then we have um, different tools here we can we can use um, circle, ellipse, uh, we also can add pots or we can simply use brush or we also can use gradient. It is up to you um, what you are going to use to get a selection and then apply this uh, particular module within the selection. So just to show you I'm using the brush tool and you can adjust the brush. You also can adjust the opacity here later on. Um, Right, so we are just drawing around here. Right, so as you can see, um, now only this area has been affected, not the entire image. Now we can adjust the shadows and also the highlights according to a preference. You also can adjust uh, soften with radius uh, bellu. It's up to you uh, what you are looking for. And then here uh, under the drone and parametric mask you can adjust the opacity. You also can change the blend mode to anything else you are looking for. You can actually try a different thing according to your preferences but I'm going with the normal settings for now. So that is the result. So now let's check the changes. This is before and this is after. So friends, this is how you simply can remove shadows from images in Darktable. I hope this tutorial will help you. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.